Good morning. Welcome to a Saturday morning. I never film Saturday mornings, this is what they look like. They're like Saturday afternoons, only usually I'm asleep. <laughs> and we're going to King's Cross and then to York for Nick and Henry's blessing, which is the only reason that will really up. <laughs> so we should be there in like, what's the time now? I went to 10. We should be there by two. Hooray, four hours time. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Toby Stupid Vlog. She's been at quest two. We're in York, unsurprisingly, that's where we were heading. It's a bit nippy. Doesn't seem to bother the locals. We're going that way. So this is our room, which you can actually see thanks to this lens. Through there is the world's most TARDIS-like bathroom. Whoa. Check out that. Yeah, so that's good. Um, here we are. Now we need to work out where other people are. <laughs> Busy bustle of York. So I've just had a bit of lunch. This is where we're going tomorrow for the reception. And as you can see, it's reasonably popular. It's because it's got a lot of cake. Don't know exactly where we are. I just know that that's where we're gonna be. <laughs> Busking. Yes. Somewhere to the right. Okay. okay. Do you think they're in? Really we're cuffling shopping because yeah. we're short cufflings. Um, <laughs> should we just see how much they are? No. Well, yeah. No, you don't want. Yeah. Them. Well, let's see if it marks. Yeah. Right. We're just going downstairs. This is the slightly old staircase. I notice you go out one door and, and then you come back in the other. <laughs> it's slightly peculiar. Oh. No, no, no. Um, yeah. So we're going on a guarded. She's the one that started this custom of wearing tights that come right up to you. And um, branching around the stage wearing as little as possible. And this was acceptable as long as you, a woman was playing a man's role. And that was one of the richest abbeys in the country. And um, in 1262, the citizens grew so jealous of the abbey's wealth. Because we're just outside the city walls. Uh, uh, you perhaps don't realise 
that we just come up through where the walls used to be. You'll go back in through them. And so the citizens stormed the abbey in 1262 because the abbey was running a market right outside the gates of the city and taking its trade away. I, don't, I think she might have bought some chitties in that area. Chitties is... Kinnell... That's one of Guy Fawkes' alleged homes. We're not entirely sure, but that face obviously now is rather synonymous with anonymous rather than Guy Fawkes. It's just before 10 o'clock, that's where you can hear the minster. There it is. Now I've got to get changed because we've got to meet in the lobby under strict instructions in 25 minutes. There we go. Now the um, instructions are being handed out as to how to get to Betty's for the eating part. Nick the purveyor of maps. Uh, today, Nick and Henrietta have invited you to share in the happiness of their marriage and to witness now as they renew their promises to each other. Nick, I'm going to ask you first, if you repeat after me. <coughs> I, Nicholas, I, Nicholas, renew my vows to you, Henrietta. Renew my vows to you, Henrietta. In the presence of this, our family and friends. In the presence of this, our family and friends. I will love and support you with compassion. I will love and support you with compassion. Respect you as an individual. Respect you as an individual. Cherish you each day. Cherish you each day. And enjoy your love always. And enjoy your love always. I Henrietta. I Henrietta. Renew my marriage vow, my ma marriage vows to you. Renew my marriage vows to you, Nick. In the presence of our family and friends. In the presence of our family and friends. I will love and support you with compassion. I will love and support you with compassion. Respect you as an individual. Respect you as an individual. Cherish you each day. Cherish you each day. And enjoy your love always. And enjoy your love always. You're allowed to hold hands. <laughs> <laughs> now the ring is a circle of homes <coughs> perfect in form, has no beginning or end. Now, Matthew, well you got the ring. <laughs> Remind you of our love. May this ring remind you of our love. And the strength of our marriage. And the strength of our marriage. Mm -hmm. so she May this ring remind you of our love. May this ring remind you of our love. And the strength of our marriage. And the strength of our marriage. Okay, we've done all the speeches. Yes, please, tea. And now we've got tea. And. Biscuits. Oh, I'm not allowed them. Shocking. This Lent thing's a joke. <laughs> I remember. I remember when I'm an atheist. <laughs> it's all about the chocolate. 
the east would be good. <laughs> yeah. It's Bond villain chair. Yeah. <laughs> Big enough for suits. They're off to the station. I'm just, yeah, we know where you're going. Follow the road. It is not a no particular coloured road, just the regular old road. <laughs> <laughs> Hello there, I thought I'd show you this jumper that I've ruined using the power of a mirror. You see this was once a nice cashmere jumper and now you can see that it's just covered it in itself. It's just created a fluff, like no fluff I've ever known. A fluff that is everywhere, it's all over the floor, it's all over the inside of my jacket. I even found it on my suit, which is impressive because I wasn't wearing this at my suit at the same time at any point ever. It's all over my t-shirt, it's all over my trousers, I don't know how it's possible. Look. I know you're going to say I need a fluff remover thing, but I fear that that would just leave the jumper in tatters. So the rule here is, if you've got a nice cashmere jumper that you really like, don't tumble dry it, because that's really stupid. There is plans foot to go for a wander and find some food. So we attempted to find somewhere to eat. This is the shambles. This road is called a shambles. It is a bit of a shambles. Um, they used to all be butcher shops and they used to throw their slops out onto the streets. And now it's full of touristy shops as you might imagine. But whether we'll find anywhere to eat is another matter. This is the view out of our window. You might see a minster or two. A lot of roofs. Just checking out, you can see our doors slightly shorter than a normal door. <laughs> it's a hobbit room. That's a normal sized door. <laughs> Beautiful day. <laughs> Everyone checking out. So this is inside the Minster. I'm just going to keep going up. It's a long way up. Oh yeah, it's beautiful up there, isn't it? Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, yeah, look at that. Here we go. <laughs> So we were going to go up the tower, but unfortunately they only do it in tours, and the first tour is quarter past two, and we get on a train at two. So. <laughs> So these are the city walls of York, which is we're going up because it's the only thing we can go up today. This is a booth in the bar. No. No, it doesn't go anywhere. It goes up here. No. Is now in the dark. Yeah. 
victory. So these are the walls. That is the minster, obviously, which we were just in. The pointy roof, the chapter house. This is some very impressive house that has, well, has a nice garden surrounded by the walls of the city which obviously does impinge on the privacy somewhat, but still, I think that's a small complaint. And if we go up here, this is where the poor scoundrels who live outside the city are. So this is the auction museum. See a big wheel over there. Very much like the one in Hyde Park for Winter Wonderland. Flowers and squirrels and walls. Lots of ruinous stuff. And he's off. So there's Betty's. We've just been around the corner to get roast meat in a sandwich. So that is a roast beef sandwich. This is a hog roast with crackling. Amazing. I feel almost full just without having opened it. <laughs> Good. <laughs> York Station. It's our train down there. This is how Tuesday mornings begin. What's jam in? What's jam in? Jam? You probably spilled jam in it. That could be it. Is there a second rose bowl in there? <laughs> My yeah, journalism isn't about helping. We've already covered that this morning. Yeah. <laughs> That's, that's me. I'll be able to hear that from through here. <laughs> another day, another who's on heart, another 14 scripts being printed. There's a very happy man in there. So there's another one. It's just outside Leicester Square. These are only floor decals, so there you go, third floor. That's all the shit that's there. If you come up the stairs. There you go, fourth floor. And here's all the shit that's here. Nice little block in the window, nicely designed. There's another one. It's actually very, very nice. Can you see that? It's a beautiful blue sky. It's a lovely summer's day in the middle of March, 1st of March. <laughs> it's not the middle at all. Yeah, it's lovely and warm, and then it's, the temperature's gonna plummet again at the weekend, so I'm just hoping it's nice by the time I get to Venice. That looks exciting. <laughs> this is what afternoon's all about. It's happening. So this is the Have a Heart Quiz Tuck Shop, uh, run by Sally, and the um, Illegal Bar, run by Liz. There, the quiz itself is happening out on the terrace. 
<laughs> Not the wise words there for us. So here's the, it's all rather red because the heaters. Um, we're not actually all red. <laughs> you just look red. It's hot. You haven't thought this through, have you? Yeah. Um, That's what's happening. Yeah. 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 This is who's happening with. Martin is my wallet. I'll have a beer, please, Martin. Yeah, I haven't got any more money on me, so... They couldn't make it! <laughs> OK. This particular round is the gold round. Uh, it's all one-hit wonders. Rush your program, this. <laughs> 70s and 80s. Oh, no, think of... This is going to be like one of Dean's rundowns. Ten pieces of music. You'll hear ten pieces of music. All I need to know from you is the name of the artist or the name of the group. Name of the artist or it could be a group. <laughs> the Big Show who came second. Devastate. Uh, sorry, Big Show came third. We came second. Second. Woo! Yeah, second. So it's all about. It's all about two. Copyright. <laughs>